News at 5, I'm Mike Sela. WTOC is honored to share the memories and legacy of a young woman from Savannah who left us much too soon. Specialist Brianna Moffitt was killed when a drone carrying weapons attacked a U.S. base called Tower 22 in Jordan. The Department of Defense says it hit housing units. The attack is still under investigation. Flags at city buildings today have been lowered in honor of Moffitt and the other two soldiers killed in this attack, all three from different parts of Georgia. Right now, you are taking a live look from our WTOC downtown Skycam, looking at that flag at half staff there on City Hall. Our Flynn Snyder has more on how Moffitt's sacrifice is being honored from City Hall. Well, during his weekly news conference, Savannah Mayor Van Johnson said the city is heartbroken in the wake of Specialist Moffitt's death. Tonight, the city of Savannah remembers one of their own who made the ultimate sacrifice, 23-year-old Army reservist Brianna Moffitt. No parent, no community ever expects to hear the type of news that Brianna's parents received. The Windsor Forest High graduate was one of three soldiers killed during a drone strike at an outpost in Jordan over the weekend. Today, the Savannah Chatham Public School System said in part, we remain deeply grateful for her service to our country and proud to call her part of the SCCPSS family. Our thoughts are with her immediate family and loved ones during this very difficult time. According to the Department of Defense, Moffitt supported Operation Inherent Resolve. Mayor Johnson called on federal officials to hold those behind the attack accountable. We must protect Americans and we must protect those of us that protect us. Now more than 6,000 miles away in her hometown, messages of support for Moffitt's dedication to service. The Bible says that there is no greater love than a man lay down his life for his friends. And so we love Brianna Moffitt for loving us. And may her memory be a blessing. Mayor Johnson says he plans to talk with Specialist Moffitt's family in the coming days to offer support. He says the soldier will get a hero's welcome when she returns home. Reporting in Savannah, Flint Snyder, WTOC News.